Try to leave around in the chamber, kid. Even when you reload, that way someone gets a drop on you, you might stand a chance. Are you a cop? No. What do you want? Same thing as you. These assholes did. Name's Sebastian. Marshal. Thanks for, uh, say. Anytime. We should get out of here. Yeah. Now. Oh, shit! Watch out!
Get the fuck out of here! I hear good things about you. The agency highly recommends you for this type of job. Let's hope they're right. We got a small window of opportunity and can't afford any mistakes. I got five contract killers I need you to take out tonight. Each one has been given an assignment, so you'll know when and where to find them. You will then take out those two men. The first one is Sebastian Wright. The other is his handler, Dorio Filantino. All the information you need is right there. Your jet back to Hong Kong leaves 7 a.m more than enough time to complete the contract. The gear you've requested is downstairs. Comprende? He doesn't look like much. He's supposed to be the best. And if he ain't? If he ain't, then we'll take care of him. But for now, it's best we go with an outsider.
Did I tell you last time? I told you not to fuck me. What have you done? You have fucked with me. And I will make sure that this is the last time you ever do.
Hey, guy. Got any change? Hey, bro. You dead for something. Hey! hey. You better walk away, you fucking pussy. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> hey! Where are you going tonight, huh? Hey! Leave me alone! What's the matter? You need a date? Back up! Come on, girl. What's wrong? Don't What's a fine-looking bitch like Leave you me walking alone. around her own for? Don't touch hey, me! Hey, hey. Calm down, all right? Calm Leave down. me alone! Hey, it's none of your problem. Back right? up! You stop? Hey! Hey! Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Hey! Mind your own business, dick! Man, that was none of your fucking business. What the fuck do you think you're doing, huh? Hey, what the fuck is your problem, man, huh? Come here. Fuck. Marshal, always late to pick up a contract. Where have you been? Dorio, always good to see you. How are you? I'm well. Although I do miss my cigarettes. Annabella, El Macchiato. Sugar water, Marshal, please. Do you, uh, need anything? Yeah, a uh, new 45. This one's getting loose. A little overuse? I'll get you a new one. Hey, 
you, Marshall. I thought I might see you. Oh, the other guys have been in over the last few days to collect contracts for tonight. How have you been? Uh, I've been, been good. Thanks for riding home last week. No, that's no problem. And thanks for not mentioning it to Dorio. He'd kill me if he knew I was out in the city by myself. I can kind of see where he's coming from. It's dangerous out there. And I wouldn't want anything to happen to you. You're 45, coming right up. Um, it was nice to see you again, Marshall. Yeah, you too. That should do the trick. Checked it. Nah, it's just a habit. Look, Dorio. Annabella mentioned all the guys are out tonight. That's not normal. There's something big going down. Must be. And it says here that the guy I've got I is... I don't need to know the details. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry. You, uh, spoken to Sebastian lately? No. I haven't seen Sebastian in about a month. Everything okay? Yeah. Yeah, I just, I've been keeping to myself lately. Anyway, thanks for the water. Uh, can't stay here all night. Mm. Marshall. Hold on a second. So what do you think of my niece? What do you mean? She's a good girl, right? Yeah, great girl. She's funny, um, smart. She's good looking too. That ain't from your side of the family there. She's been uh, asking about you a lot lately, you know, always up in my ears, he's single, he's... but you're not interested, are you? Dario! I can hear everything you're saying and you're embarrassing me. Well, then go back with your MyPad or iPod or whatever you kids call it these days and stop listening. I promised my brother I would look out for her. You're a decent guy and no disrespect meant, but we both know that what you do is not safe. Yeah, I know. You got nothing to worry about. I'll keep my distance. Annabella needs to concentrate on her studies and she could do without the distraction. See you later, Dario. Good luck.
Away.
Uh, easy, boy. Easy, boy. All right. Sure. What happened? I don't know. All I know is the set up in the sky. You knew I'd be there. God, have you heard from anyone else? No, nothing. Oh, all right, it's all right. All right. This is gonna hurt. Yeah. One, two, three. Ah, fuck. The boys are picking up the next shipment. Next Thursday. Nine o'clock. What do you need from me? Next school will be good. To ensure a clear run back to the factory. Not a problem. I'll see what I can do. Uh, sorry. Hello? What? I'll be right down. Is there a problem? A uh, small one, but nothing to be concerned about. I'll be back shortly. Just fucking turned up. What the fuck is going on? Number five. Away. What about the other two, Wright and Filantino? Are they done? Hey, buddy, are you listening to me? I come to update the more gun. Give him your piece. Not that one, you idiot. You're unregistered. If this guy is smart, he's on his way out of town. If he's not, he's a Filantino who's trying to figure out what the fuck just happened. Either way, you get your Chinese ass downtown, take out Filantino, then write. You think you can handle that? Mo. Oh. Mo, oh. do you think you can handle that? Do you hear what I just said? Yeah. You better hope so. Otherwise, you're finished. I've heard what the agency does to fuck ups like you! Try this. It'll make you feel better. Oh, no, no. It's green tea. You're not made of bad sugar. It's okay. Thank you. So, uh, how are you feeling? Is the pain any better? Uh, a little. I'll be right. How did it happen? Can't get a hold of Sebastian. There's no answer. Okay, look, I need to get over there. I just pulled eight inches of wood out of your side. You need to take a break. Oh, Dario, I'm gonna be okay. What do you need? You know what I need. Please be careful. I worry about you. And, uh, with what my uncle said earlier, it's kind of true. Annabella, that's not a good thing. I'm glad you feel the same way. Look, I don't think Dario would approve. <laughs> He's not my father, Marshall. No, but he is the closest you have to one. Tell me you don't feel the same. That's not what I'm talking about. Look, with what I do, it's just best if we keep things simple. Simple? Yeah. You mean safe. What are you so scared of? Here you go, Marsh. You should do the trick. Thank you. Look, Dorio, I need you to stay here and lock up and sit tight till I get back. Be careful. Marshal. Don't worry.
Sebastian. Hey, Sebastian. Marshall. What are you doing here? What am I doing here? Answer your fucking phone. <laughs> Dario's been trying to call you. I must have fallen asleep. It looks like you passed out. You okay? No, not really. It's been five years to the day. Look, I'm sorry, Marshall, but you're gonna have to leave. Sebastian, I can't go, and we need to talk. Not tonight. Look, right now, look, I was attacked. Attacked? Yeah, look, I don't know, this fucking Chinese guy, I was on assignment, and I was ambushed. He knew I would be there. You weren't supposed to be on assignment tonight. Yeah, well, I sure as shit did not have the night off. Look, all the other guys were on, too. All four of them. God damn it. I haven't issued a contract since the Davies job. That was two weeks ago. You did get that, right? Yeah, and I took him out. No problems. You see, the only person who could have sent you guys out on a job tonight was Dario. And what about your contact? Callahan? <laughs> Impossible. He doesn't even know about Dario. I don't know. Well, something's up. And if you didn't issue the contracts, only Dario and Callahan know what we do. Well, as well as all the other guys. Yeah, but they don't know about you and Callahan. They just deal with Dorio. Which might explain why you're okay. Look, God, Dorio doesn't know about this place, does he? No. No, we talk on the phone. I've been down to the restaurant a couple of times. I issue all the contracts through a post office box. Look, I'm gonna give Callahan a call and see if he's heard anything. Damn it. Dorio has gotta have something to do with this. No. Not Dario. Look, he seemed to have no idea about what's going on, just like you. Okay. You go back down to the restaurant, and see if you can find out anything else. I know you got a lot of respect for Dario. Yeah, I do. We can't trust him. He could be a threat, Marshal. Annabella, Marshall will be fine. He's a big boy and he can take care of himself. Now, will you please sit down? You're making me nervous. Headache. Well, what's Marshall's story anyway? Does he have a girlfriend? <sighs> Annabella, Marshall is not interested in you. And even if he was, I forbid it. You forbid it? You can't do that. And besides, I think he likes me. Annabella, you have to realize what a life with Marshall would mean to you. You're studying law. You don't need somebody like Marshall in your life fucking that up for you. You need to be with somebody stable, like a, a, a banker or a, a lawyer or, or a chef. A chef? You're funny, Dario. Shit, basement, now! Motherfucker, take the wrong restaurant! Turn around and
There's nothing you can do for me now. No fight, Marshall. No. <laughs> Christ, don't you ever knock? Yeah, lock the fucking door. Where the hell's Dario? Dario's dead. Oh no. It's the same guy. You guys need to get out of here. It's not safe anymore. I talked to Callahan. He reckons a guy called Slate is behind it all. Slate? This guy is seriously bad news. Callahan and his men are coming over here. They'll protect me. But I don't know about you two. So you need to get the hell out of here. Leave the city. Go to East Point. You'll be safe there. Look, that's a bad fucking idea. You shouldn't be trusting Callahan or anybody else right now. Not after all this shit. He's a cop, Marshal. 
One of the good ones. Yeah, and you know that? Oh, wait, he's going he's to be chief of police soon. God. Look, Callahan doesn't know how I get the job done. He just knows I get it done. He's not interested in the finer details. God, again, Sebastian. Dumb fucking idea. Look, you're taking a huge risk putting all your faith in Callahan. Look, I need you to come with us. Come here. Come here. Every day I think about how I couldn't protect my own brother. Right now I'm doing everything I can to try to protect you. You gotta go. This opens the safe in my study if anything should happen to me. You've been a good friend to me, Marshall. And I never thanked you for not leaving me there. Look, Sebastian, please don't thank me. Look, if it wasn't for me, you'd, you wouldn't need those. That's bullshit, and you know it. You saved me. I'm, I'm sorry if I haven't been around lately. And hey, hey, hey. You okay? I don't know. Look, this shit gets to you after a while. If I could have it all back, I never would have trained you up for this sort of work. But you were such an insistent son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah. God, was I, huh? It's never too late, you know. Thank you for everything. You're a good man, Marshal. So are you, my friend. Go and get the fuck out of here. I'll catch up with you guys in a few days' time. Okay, time to go in. Oh, and Marshall, ditch the Chevy. It's probably hot by now. Take one of mine. It's an old abandoned college just out of town. Well, we're gonna be safe there. Sebastian. Callahan, secure the area. Keep watch. So, did you hear anything from, what did you say his name was? Dario. Yeah, Dario. Anything? Dario's dead. Shit. How's your guy? He's fine. Where is he? He's safe. Should I send some of my men over to him? My guy knows how to take care of himself. So, what are we gonna do now? Wait till this goddamn mist blows over, then start all over again, I guess. Tell me about this Slate character. He's been coming up from the south, killing everyone and anything in his path. He's been taking out the competition one by one. He's shooting for the top. He's almost there, too. Has he or any of his men ever been on any of our lists? No, not a one. Strange, huh? Yeah. About time you got here.
stay there and shut the fuck up. Oh my! The last guy's still out there somewhere. Where is he? Fuck you. Listen, if you don't tell me where he is, I'm gonna- Gonna what? You think I got anything to lose? You think I give a shit? Fuck! <coughs> Search the house. Find me something, God damn it. You son of a bitch. Maybe if you paid me, we wouldn't be in this position. What are they paying you? <laughs> Enough to retire. Maybe run for mayor. Don't look so surprised. Who do you think you've been knocking off these past few months? Slate's competition. <laughs> That's what I like about you, Sebastian. You never ask questions. You just kill whoever the hell I tell you to. Why well, kill my man? Dead finks don't talk. There's a fucked up pickup in the garage and one of his cars is missing. Please tell me it was one of the ones we tagged? It was. Get Stevens on the line. Find out where he is. You've been tracking me? Hey, if you got the toys, use them. How else do you think we found out about the contracts and Doria? Good move trying to cover yourself by issuing to a third party. Just not good enough. They're heading east on Forest Hill Way. Forest Hill Way? East Point. Yeah, Sebastian owns it. He's on his way over there now. Download the address onto his PDA. You take care of this, and then head over to... Oh, wait a minute. Fuck that. Take care of him, and then get your ass over to the airport. If you can handle that without fucking up, then maybe I won't report you to the agency. My guy's no pushover, Callahan. You're a dead man. <laughs> well, that makes two of us. Keep smiling, asshole. I'm sorry, you were saying? Oh, by the way, that guy who sold your brother the bad smack, he gets out in a couple of months. I'm sure I can find some work for him. I can always use a guy like that. <laughs> Slate on the line. Slate, Callahan. I no longer have confidence in the import. I need you to send some men out to. What's the address at East Point? 1155 Forest Hill Way. 1155 Forest Hill Way. I told you this was a bad move. We should have taken care of this ourselves. Look, just do it. It's the last hit, and then we're in the clear, but we need to make sure this guy gets taken out before he moves. I'll pay you double what he's paying you. If you take him out, and all of his men. I am sorry. Agency prefers success above all else. Oomju, Song Li Yaching. Bowman will take you to the airport. I'll tell the agency that you completed the contract. No, you won't. Not unless I do complete contract. How dare you point your gun at me. Look, I've taken care of everything. My employer is sending a hit squad to his location. He's as good as dead. If you go to the airport, everything will be okay. You betray your friend in there. Easy to betray me. You little prick. I go now. Complete my contract. If you speak to agency about this, dead. Stand down. Hong Dai Chang. Put him away. Let him go.
Yutting! Damn it, Bowman, do what he says. Let him go. Yutting! Keys. Harrison. Tag team taken out to East Point. I don't think that's a very good idea, sir. He can't be trusted. He's a loose end. Take Lucas, get a team together, men we can rely on. We're not gonna get away with it, Pete. We're gonna have internal affairs all over us. Take a few pounds, stash them at the scene, and we'll make it look like a bust. Where do we see we got the intel from? I don't fucking know. I'll work it out with Slate. Just do what I say, get out there, and take him out. Fine. Lucas, go get your car. Son of a bitch. Looks like a dump. Yeah. Hey. Hey, what kind of place is this? It's a training camp. Sebastian told me everything he knew here. Look, nobody knows about this place. You're going to be safe. OK. Come on. What are we going to do? I don't know. First, we need a rest. Come on. There's food and shower in the back. Shower? Sounds good to me. Oh, look, showers are through there and the towels are on the drawers. Uh, okay. much better. Why don't you come over here and let me look at your bandages? Uh, they're okay. not sleeping. I did a good job. Were you shot? 
How'd that happen? Look, I'd rather not talk about it. Okay. I understand. I was 23 at the time. And my wife had just given birth to this, this beautiful baby girl. She was some, um... and I know we were young, but we could not wait to start our own family. And as we were leaving the hospital, this guy stumbles in, covered in blood, and everybody started panicking and. Then there was gunshots. And I had my baby girl in my arms. And I was trying to protect her, but I couldn't. I couldn't do it. Yeah. Anyway, after, after I recovered, all I wanted to do was get revenge. And that's how I met Sebastian. He took me in and gave me direction, but lately I just don't know. I just, I long for something more. I want a family. But after all the death that I've caused and everything that I've done, that's something I don't think that I deserve. Marshall, your heart is in the right place. You're just trying to protect people. Come here. If you don't like who you are, then change. But know that what you did, you did because you felt it was right at the time, and there's no need to regret that. I'll be there for you, if you'll let me. Get up and get dressed.
Marshall, what's going on? Who were those guys? Look, we don't have time. Trust me, but we have to go now. Gun.
Best, huh? Say, Guy. Ho Chang Li got Chung Wu So. The old Chi Logan. He's a joking arm layer. I have no idea what the fuck you just said. Who sent you? Who fucking sent you? Take the car and head south to Shell Harbor. But Marsh... No buts. If I'm not there by sundown, then you keep going. I'll be there. Marshall!
Yes, yeah, Stevens. Any word from Bowman? Fuck. This is all gone to shit. How do you plan on fixing this? Don't worry, we'll figure something out. <laughs> I already have. Pack it up and get the fuck out of here. I didn't think you were going to make it. Can we go now? I'm not coming with you. I have to go back. I have to continue Sebastian's work. Take this. Head south and find a town and move on. No, I'm coming with you. I want to be with you and we can do it together. I can't, Annabella. I care too much about you and I need you to be safe. This isn't up for negotiation. It's not a game. You can't wake up one day and want your old life back because it's not going to exist. The life I had is already gone. I can't go back. I know. But you can start over. Yeah. But only with you. I'm not going to... Okay. Okay. But it's gonna be hard. And you're gonna need to learn some things so that I know if anything happens to me that you're gonna be safe. Okay. But this time, I'll drive. 